Cameroon, land of glory, land of promise, a country with over 250 ethnic groups and diverse cultural heritage, remains an island of peace in the zone plunged with civil wars and coup d'etats. The cultural ramifications of Cameroon's 52 years after reunification is a story with diverse views. However, it is certain that culture in the form of films, music, fashion, books, paintings, and so on, is a unifying factor which has been exploited by many other sovereign nations to communicate and sell their opinions and positions to the rest of the world. Most recently, we caught up with a young, vibrant actress and producer who hails from Bafusam, Lucy Member Bose, a Douala based French speaking artist who has been impacting a generation as an actress and producer. She decided to bridge the gap. Yeah, basically, I was uh, a dancer, modeling, I was not acting. So one day I got contacted by a producer who needed me in, in a movie. So I just go there for fun. Really, I was not going there like I want to, sh to, to be an actress, no. I was going there for fun because I like to be on set. But during that experience, it was really enrichment for me. And I noticed that there were that virus, that acting virus sleeping in me. So since that time, I decided that I will be an actress. Like many others, she holds a strong view of unity and considers it a blessing. Yeah, the different. Let's start by... My personal experience as an actress is that when it's French, if I need to, to read a script, maybe let's say one time and get involved. In English, I need to read twice because, as I said, I need to, to be sure, to make sure that as the, 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 the screenplay and I are, are looking at the same direction. So it's a, it's a challenge for me to act in English, but I like it and I have always had the support from all my colleagues in English who always support me on set. Uh, even if I keep my, my, my French accent, they help me to understand more and to improve myself in English. Even before granting the interview, Lucy says she would love to speak in English and in case she encounters difficulties in the course of the interview, she will be corrected. To her, there is no divide, especially when it comes to cinema. Let's say in Cameroon uh, movie industry, let us not separate English and French. Cameroon movie industry is one. So, like say the difference, is, it's always a difference between one producer and another one, one director and another one. It's not a difference between Francophone and English or French movie or English movie. We have the same culture, maybe we are speaking both French and English, but we have the same culture, we have the same identity. The government of Cameroon has put in efforts to consolidate unity, especially with the creation of the Ministry of Culture a few decades ago, which is arguably a ministry with the greatest responsibility of manifesting unity in Cameroon. The ministry's flagship event, the Festival of Arts and Culture, FENAC, which is sadly a two-yearly event, remains a valuable gateway not only for cultural reawakening in Cameroon and the rest of the world, but also a point of convergence for Cameroon's 250 ethnic groups and diverse cultural heritage. As preparations for Cameroon's reunification celebration in Boya intensify, patriots, historians and citizens of Cameroon and especially the organization committee are putting all in place for a successful event. In this light, cultural professionals in and out of the country are calling on the government to give Cameroonian filmmakers in particular and culture in general an opportunity to give a new meaning to unity. The powers of filmmaking as a unifying factor cannot be underestimated, just like it is commonly said amongst filmmakers that as Basek Bakobio is to the unity of filmmakers in Cameroon, Africa and the rest of the world at the Krang Noir Film Festival, so is the Cameroon film industry and culture in general to the celebration of Cameroon's reunification.